Imagine a world where time travel is as commonplace as taking a flight to another country. A world where the limitations we currently know and understand are merely stepping stones to greater possibilities. A world where the line between science fiction and reality is blurred. And the future is no longer a distant concept, but an active participant in our present. The future, as we envision it, is a realm of endless possibilities. It's a canvas yet to be painted, a story yet to be written. It holds the promise of technological marvels that can revolutionize our lives, from teleportation to sentient AI, from interstellar travel to immortality. These aren't mere fantasies, but potential realities that could redefine our existence. But like Pandora's box, the future also holds challenges and uncertainties. As we push the boundaries of science and technology, we unlock new dilemmas. Ethical quandaries hover over advancements like genetic engineering and artificial intelligence. Who gets to decide what's right and wrong in a world where we can manipulate life and consciousness itself? Similarly, the promise of limitless energy sources or the ability to colonize other planets brings with it questions about resource distribution, societal structures, and our very identity as a species. Will these advancements lead to a utopia? Or will they exacerbate existing inequalities and create new ones? The future is a double-edged sword. It offers solutions to our current problems, but also presents new ones we can't foresee. It's like a game of chess where every move opens up new avenues while also creating potential pitfalls. Yet despite these challenges, there's an undeniable allure to the future. It's a testament to human ingenuity and our relentless pursuit of progress. It's a reminder that we are not mere spectators in the dance of time, but active choreographers shaping the rhythm and flow of our collective destiny. So, what does the future hold for us? That's a question only time can answer. But one thing is certain, the future is not a predetermined path, but a journey we're crafting together. The future, a realm filled with endless opportunities, yet shrouded in mystery and uncertainty. Work as we know it is changing rapidly. What do you think the future holds for our careers? The traditional nine to five office grind is quickly becoming a thing of the past. A global shift towards remote work is underway and it's not just because of pandemics. The digital revolution has made it possible for us to work from anywhere at any time. This shift is not only changing where we work, but also how we work, making flexibility and adaptability the new norm but the transformation doesn't stop there. The rise of artificial intelligence and automation is revolutionizing the work landscape. Repetitive tasks are being automated, freeing up time for more creative and complex problem-solving tasks. Jobs that didn't exist a decade ago are now in high demand. Think of roles like AI ethicists, digital privacy consultants, and virtual reality designers. However, this shift also prompts a critical question. Will robots take our jobs? While it's true that some roles will become obsolete, it's also true that new ones will emerge. It's a cycle of creative destruction and creation that has been the bedrock of human progress for centuries. This brings us to the need for continuous learning and upskilling. As the saying goes, the only constant in life is change. This is particularly true for the future of work. To stay relevant and competitive, we need to be lifelong learners, constantly updating our skills and knowledge. The future of work is also likely to place greater emphasis on soft skills. Creativity, emotional intelligence, critical thinking. These are traits that machines can't replicate. They are what will set us apart in the future job market. In conclusion, the future of work is exciting, dynamic and full of opportunities. It brings with it challenges, certainly, but also the potential for greater flexibility, creativity and job satisfaction. As the nature of work evolves, so must we. We must adapt, learn and grow, because the future of work isn't something that happens to us, it's something we create. The classroom of the future might look very different from what we're used to. Traditional school buildings lined with rows of desks and a chalkboard at the front may become relics of the past. Instead, we're moving towards a more decentralized, flexible and personalized approach to education. Let's dive into what that might look like. First, let's talk about online learning. With advancements in technology, we've seen a significant rise in online learning platforms that offer a myriad of courses on a wide range of subjects. These platforms break the geographical barriers and make education accessible to anyone with an internet connection. They're not just for the typical student either. 
but also for lifelong learners who want to pick up a new skill or delve into a new area of interest. Next, imagine a world where education is tailored to each individual's learning style, pace and interests. This is the potential of personalized education. Gone are the days of one-size-fits-all teaching methods. Instead, with the help of artificial intelligence and machine learning, we can analyze a student's strengths, weaknesses and learning patterns to create a customized learning plan. This not only makes learning more enjoyable but also more effective. Lastly, let's explore the exciting role of virtual and augmented reality in education. These technologies can transport students to different times and places, making learning more immersive and engaging. Picture a history lesson where students can walk through ancient Rome or a science class where they can explore the human body from the inside. The possibilities are truly endless. In conclusion, the future of education is set to be a dynamic journey. With advancements in technology, we're moving away from traditional teaching methods and embracing a more personalized, immersive and accessible approach to learning. Education, like many other sectors, is on the brink of a revolution. Mars, the final frontier. Will we become an interplanetary species in the future? Mars, our ruddy celestial neighbor, has long captured the human imagination. Today, it's no longer the stuff of science fiction to suggest that we might one day call Mars home. Visionaries like Elon Musk are already paving the way with ambitious plans for Mars colonization. The goal? To transform humanity into a multi-planetary species. Imagine a network of Martian colonies, self-sustaining biospheres where humans can live, work and thrive. These colonies would be a testament to human ingenuity, a beacon of hope in the vast expanse of space. But of course, the journey to making this a reality is fraught with challenges. From the technical hurdles of space travel to the physiological effects of living on Mars, there's a universe of problems to solve. Yet every great journey begins with a single step and we've already taken ours. But Mars isn't the only exciting frontier in space exploration. There's also the tantalizing prospect of discovering extraterrestrial life. As we send more sophisticated probes to the outer reaches of our solar system and beyond, we're constantly expanding our search for life. Could there be simple microbial life forms lurking beneath the icy surface of Jupiter's moon Europa? Or perhaps complex intelligent life broadcasting signals from a distant galaxy? The possibilities are as endless as the universe itself. Then there's space tourism, a concept that's already becoming a reality. Companies like Virgin Galactic and Blue Origin are working hard to make space travel accessible to the average person. Imagine holidaying on a space station, gazing down at the Earth from above. It's a perspective that might just change the way we see ourselves and our place in the cosmos. The universe is vast and we are just beginning to explore its mysteries. As we look to the future, we can only imagine where our curiosity and ingenuity will take us. As we stand on the precipice of a new era of exploration, one thing is clear. The future of space is as boundless as the stars themselves. What if you could edit your genes to eliminate diseases? Imagine the power of customizing your genetic makeup to ward off inherited conditions, or even fine-tuning it to enhance your physical or mental abilities. This is the potential of gene editing a burgeoning field in medicine that's already showing promise in early stage trials. Our DNA is like an intricate blueprint shaping every aspect of our bodies and our health. However, sometimes this blueprint can contain errors leading to a myriad of diseases. Gene editing technologies like the revolutionary CRISPR could allow us to correct these errors at their source, potentially curing conditions that were once thought to be incurable. But the future of medicine isn't just about rewriting our genetic code. It's about personalizing healthcare to the individual. With the advent of big data and artificial intelligence, doctors could soon have the ability to tailor treatments to each patient's unique genetic makeup, lifestyle, and even microbiome. This is personalized medicine, a shift from a one-size-fits-all approach to a bespoke healthcare experience designed around you. Imagine walking into a doctor's office in the future. Instead of a broad diagnosis and a generic treatment plan, you're presented with a comprehensive health profile mapped out using data from your genome, your lifestyle habits, even your gut bacteria. Your treatment isn't just reactive targeting symptoms as they appear, but proactive, predicting potential health risks before they become a problem. Artificial intelligence adds another layer to this personalized approach. 
AI algorithms trained on vast amounts of medical data could assist doctors in diagnosing diseases, planning treatments, and predicting outcomes. These algorithms could even monitor your health in real time, alerting you to potential issues before they escalate. As we move into the future, the line between sci-fi and reality blurs. The once fantastical idea of editing our genes, personalizing our medicine, and utilizing AI in healthcare is becoming a tangible reality. But as with any technological revolution, it's not without its challenges and ethical considerations. Yet the potential benefits are undeniable. The future of medicine holds immense promise for improving human health. It's a future that's exciting, hopeful, and within our grasp. Let's embrace it. Could we power our planet without harming the environment? A question that has been at the forefront of our minds as we inch closer to a future where traditional energy sources may no longer be viable or sustainable. Imagine a world where renewable energy is not a mere supplement, but the backbone of our power supply. Sunlight, wind, water, and the heat of the earth itself could provide us with an endless stream of power. Solar panels and wind turbines are becoming more efficient and affordable, making it possible for more and more homes and businesses to generate their own electricity. Hydroelectric and geothermal power are also making strides, proving that we can harness the natural forces around us in a sustainable way. But what about nuclear fusion? Unlike nuclear fission, which generates power through the splitting of atoms and produces dangerous radioactive waste, fusion combines atoms and produces a vast amount of energy with little to no harmful byproducts. Fusion power has been the holy grail of energy research for decades. If we can crack the code, we could have a nearly unlimited clean source of power. In addition to finding new sources of energy, we're also learning how to use what we have more efficiently. Energy efficient technologies are reducing the amount of power we need to run our homes, our vehicles and our industries. LED lighting, electric cars and smart grids are just a few examples of how we're making every watt count. The future of energy isn't just about finding new ways to generate power, it's about rethinking our relationship with energy itself. It's about creating a world where we not only use less power, but where the power we use does less harm. It's about understanding that energy isn't just a commodity, but a precious resource that we need to use wisely and respectfully. A sustainable future is within our reach if we make the right choices. The technology is here, the potential is enormous, and the benefits are clear. It's up to us to seize the opportunity and make the dream of a clean, sustainable energy future a reality. Could we feed the world without harming the environment? A question that has been the catalyst for a multitude of innovations. Let's explore a few of these potential game changers. Lab-grown meat, vertical farming, and genetically modified crops. First, let's dive into the world of lab-grown meat. Imagine a future where your steak doesn't come from a farm, but from a laboratory. This isn't science fiction, it's happening today. Scientists have developed a way to grow meat from animal cells, eliminating the need for livestock farming, which is a significant contributor to greenhouse gas emissions. Lab-grown meat could reduce the environmental impact of our diets and potentially pave the way for a more sustainable future. Next up is vertical farming. Traditional farming methods consume vast amounts of land and water, but what if we could grow crops upwards instead of outwards? Vertical farming allows us to do just that. By stacking layers of crops on top of one another inside climate-controlled buildings, we can grow food more efficiently, using less water and land. This could be a game-changer for urban areas where space is at a premium, and access to fresh produce can sometimes be limited. Finally, let's talk about genetically modified crops. Now, this is a topic that can be somewhat controversial, but there's no denying its potential. By tweaking the genetic makeup of plants, we can create crops that are more resistant to pests, diseases, and harsh weather conditions. This could lead to higher crop yields and less reliance on harmful pesticides and fertilizers. In conclusion, these innovations in food production hold the promise of a future where we can feed the world's population without causing undue harm to our planet. But as with all technologies, they must be developed and used responsibly. Feeding the world sustainably is one of the great challenges of our time. And it's a challenge that with the help of science and innovation, we are increasingly equipped to meet. The future of food is not just about what we eat, but how we produce it. And that future is looking more sustainable, efficient and hopeful than ever before. 
What if you could travel from New York to London in less than an hour? Now let's dive into the fascinating world of future transportation. Imagine hurtling through a vacuum tube at speeds exceeding 600 miles per hour. Sounds like science fiction, right? But this is the promise of Hyperloop, a concept that could revolutionize our approach to travel. This system, powered by renewable energy, could make long commutes a thing of the past. Not only would it shrink our world even further, but it would do so without contributing to climate change. But it's not just about speed, it's also about autonomy. Self-driving cars are no longer a distant dream. They're here and they're learning fast. Machine learning algorithms are powering vehicles that can navigate complex cityscapes with ease. Imagine stepping into your car, inputting your destination and just sitting back, catching up on your favorite book or even getting some extra sleep. Autonomous vehicles could give us back time, one of our most precious resources. And then there are electric vehicles or EVs. They're not just cleaner, they're also more efficient. The internal combustion engine's day is unnumbered and the EV revolution is just getting started. Silent, smooth and sustainable electric vehicles are transforming our roads and our cities. But the future of transportation isn't just about what's on the ground. Drone technology is advancing at a breakneck speed. From delivering packages to providing emergency medical supplies, drones are poised to become an essential part of our lives. And let's not forget about space travel. With companies like SpaceX and Blue Origin, we're seeing the dawn of a new era where space travel could become as commonplace as hopping on a plane. The future of transportation is a thrilling ride. It's about speed, yes, but it's also about efficiency, autonomy, and most importantly, sustainability. So buckle up because the future of transportation is fast, efficient, and sustainable. Could machines ever become as intelligent as humans? This is a question that has intrigued and puzzled us for decades. It's a question that leads us into the realm of Artificial General Intelligence, or AGI. AGI refers to a type of artificial intelligence that can understand, learn, and apply knowledge across a wide range of tasks at a level equal to or even surpassing that of a human being. While this concept may sound like science fiction, many leading researchers and futurists believe that we are on a trajectory heading towards this reality. They project that within a few decades, we might witness the birth of AGI, reshaping our world in unimaginable ways. It could solve complex problems, generate new scientific theories, and even create art that rivals human creativity. However, with such extraordinary potential comes extraordinary responsibility. The development of AGI brings to the forefront the critical issue of AI ethics. How do we ensure that these superintelligent entities act in a way that is beneficial to humanity? How do we prevent misuse or the concentration of too much power in the hands of a few? These are questions that need to be addressed as we move closer to this future, which brings us to another significant concern, the impact of AI on jobs. With AI becoming increasingly capable, many jobs, especially those involving routine tasks, are at risk of automation. Yet it's not all doom and gloom. Just as with previous technological revolutions, AI is also expected to create new jobs, ones we can't even imagine today. It's crucial that we prepare for this shift, focusing on education and training that enhance our uniquely human skills. In conclusion, the future of artificial intelligence is both fascinating and complex. It's a future filled with immense potential and challenges. As we stand on the brink of this new era, one thing is clear. Artificial intelligence is reshaping our world in ways we are only beginning to understand. Scene script. Can we reverse the damage done to our planet? This question often lingers in our minds as we confront the daunting reality of climate change. The answer may well lie in the innovative solutions that we as a global community are exploring and developing. One such solution is carbon capture technologies. These marvels of human ingenuity are designed to trap carbon dioxide directly from the atmosphere or at the point of emission. They work like giant air filters sucking in air and separating the carbon dioxide. The captured carbon can then be stored safely underground or used in various industrial applications. The potential of these technologies is immense. By harnessing them, we could not only halt the increase of CO2 in our atmosphere, but also actively reduce it. But our efforts to combat climate change don't stop there. 
Geoengineering, a term that might sound like it's straight out of a science fiction novel, is another frontier we are exploring. This involves large-scale interventions in the Earth's natural systems to counteract climate change. Ideas range from solar radiation management, which would reflect a small percentage of sunlight back into space, to ocean fertilization, which involves stimulating the growth of carbon-absorbing plankton. While these technological solutions are promising, they are not silver bullets. They come with their own challenges and uncertainties. It's essential to remember that they are part of a larger strategy, not a replacement for reducing our carbon emissions. This brings us to the most crucial factor in combating climate change, individual action. Each one of us has a role to play. From reducing our carbon footprint by embracing sustainable lifestyles, to advocating for policies that protect our environment, our actions can make a significant difference. Climate change is a global challenge that requires global solutions. It's a test of our collective will and ability to safeguard our planet for future generations. The future of our planet depends on the actions we take today. What does the future hold for us as a species? A question as old as time, but never more relevant than today. As we gaze into the vast expanse of tomorrow, we see a world shaped by our dreams and our actions. We stand on the precipice of a new era, an epoch where the boundaries of human potential may be stretched beyond our wildest imaginations. This is the era of transhumanism. Transhumanism is a movement that believes in the enhancement of the human condition through advanced technology. It's about transcending our biological limitations, about augmenting our physical and intellectual capabilities, about living longer, healthier and more fulfilling lives. Imagine a world where aging is a thing of the past, where diseases are eradicated, where our senses are amplified and our minds are augmented. But as with any leap forward, there are ethical implications to consider. The advent of advanced technologies brings with it a host of questions. Who will have access to these enhancements? Will they create a divide between those who can afford them and those who cannot? How do we maintain our humanity in a world where man and machine become increasingly intertwined? These are complex questions that require thoughtful and inclusive dialogue. Yet amidst these uncertainties, one thing remains clear. The future is ours to shape. We are not merely passive observers in the grand theater of time. We are the architects of tomorrow. Every decision we make, every action we take, shapes the world of tomorrow. Our focus should not merely be on developing advanced technologies, but on fostering a future that is bright, hopeful, and inclusive. A future where technology serves humanity, not the other way around. A future where every individual, regardless of their background or circumstances, has the opportunity to reach their fullest potential. As we stand on the brink of this new era, let us remember this. The future is not something that happens to us, but something we create. Together we can build a future that is bright, hopeful, and inclusive. This is the future of humanity. This is our future. Let's make it a great one.